Hello, welcome to today's video. I'm just gonna tell you right now, after a couple of weeks of kind of long videos, I am really trying to keep this one short, but full of impact. Welcome to my channel. My name is Kay and this is Dress For My Day. And today I'm sharing with you seven modern casual summer outfits. You're gonna love this ladies. We're just gonna have a little fashion show here, but I am showing you things that I've really been wearing recently and I've been loving. You know, a couple of weeks ago in my long video, I did share with you about how to get out of a style rut. And one of the things we talked about there was making sure that you let your style evolve. And one of the tips I gave you was to try some new brands and some new stores and perhaps to walk into some stores that you don't normally shop. So I did that this past week. I went to Anthropology, which I love their clothes, but I hardly ever shop there because it is a little funky. <laughs> It can be a little funky and sometimes it feels a little younger because like my daughter shops there and and but i do love their things and i've worn things from there for years i also went to ever eve where things tend to be a little bit fresher a little bit more modern so i pushed myself just like i encouraged you to do and so these outfits are results some of that shopping trip but also just of me trying to make modern choices you know i've mentioned here before too in a couple of videos about how to not look older than you really are or how to look Look not frumpy or how to look modern and I've talked to you about uh, instead of trying to look younger try to look modern and when we look modern we actually do look younger or we look our most vibrant we look youthful and fresh and so that's one of the keys I think to staying in the game right if we want to stay relevant if we want our adult children to pay attention to us listen to what we have to say to think hey mama knows what she's talking about and if we want to stay engaged with our community and and still feel vibrant and like we are on top of things then ladies we have got to start making some modern choices in our outfits so today i'm going to point out the modern choices in each of these outfits now these may not be your style and i get that but what i want you to pay attention to is the modern choices i made and i'm going to point those out let's get going with outfit number one First, I'm wearing some kind of wide leg black pants. These are, of course, ankle length, crop length, what you call it. They are from Anthropology, and oh my word. You know, I wear a lot of linen, but I'm just showing, I think, one pair of linen pants and maybe one linen jacket today, and that's it, because these pants are so lightweight. They have lots of stretch. They are so comfortable. These are amazing. They come or they came in every color and a few prints, but I've noticed they're kind of picked over in the different sizes. They've come in petites and talls too. But I really think for me, going with these black ones was just right, right up my alley. And here I've just paired them with a really kind of looks elevated because it's that camel color. But this is a little cloth and stone sleeveless collared top, button front top. And it does have the little drawstring at the hem, which I've kind of decided I like those drawstrings because you can wear it so many different ways. So first I've worn it, uh, you know, pulled together a little bit in the drawstring, but I've tucked the shirt in the front. So I've given a little front tuck and I've belted the pants. I think the modern choices here, of course, are those pants and also just that kind of a casual but elevated looking top, really modern. I've worn it with my black little sandals here. I think these are Cole Haan. I think I got them at Kohl's. I'll give you a link to everything below. Today, I think I got links to almost everything, everything, jewelry, accessories, everything below. So I love the way this comes together. I also think just keeping those color choices minimal is very modern. So those modern pants really pull this outfit together. Now, do you have to belt this? No, you don't. You don't have to belt it. You could even untuck it. You could use the little drawstring to make the top hang a little lower. What you do want to do is make sure that the bottom portion of your outfit is at least two thirds of the visual part, the visual compilation of your outfit. So the top should only be one third and the bottom portion of your outfit should be two thirds. So you don't want your outfit to hang down to where it like chops your outfit in half, okay? Especially when you're wearing cropped or ankle length pants. That's really important to make sure you try to achieve those proportions. Now for my second outfit, I'm wearing those same pants again, but I just wore them a little differently. Here I am wearing some great little sneakers. 
These are actually my on cloud sneakers. They're really kind of a real running shoe, but you just slip them on so, so on trend. This running shoe, retro kind of running shoe looking sneaker. Then I topped it with another really modern choice. So this is what they call a twofer. It looks like a shirt tucked inside of a sweater, you know, a little sweater thing here, short sleeve sweater, but it's not. It's just a collar and then the bottom part of the shirt. So it's very lightweight. You may look like I'm warm. Oh no, this is very cool, very summery. Unfortunately, I don't find this anywhere on the website. I bought it at the store. I'm not seeing it on the website, but they do have some other things similar. So I'll link you to some of those, but I just want you to see that this is a very modern choice. When I found this in the store, I thought, okay, you can't pull that off. I put it on and I loved it. I just felt like it's darling, it's fresh. I know it may not be everybody's cup of tea, but I think this outfit looks really modern and really youthful. And if I had done it with some colors, you're gonna see some colored pants in a minute, then I might start looking a little too, like I was trying to look young. But I think because I wore black and I wore more neutrals, I think it looks my age, it looks age appropriate, looks a little sophisticated, you know, if you will, but it also looks really modern and fresh. So those sneakers, those wide leg pants, and this little, two fur top, very modern choices. My third outfit is a denim skirt. Denim skirts are really trending and you could certainly wear your denim skirt that you've had in your closet for years. But the modern choice is this particular silhouette of denim skirt, which is very much on trend this year. And that is that deconstructed blue jeans look for a modern skirt. So you see it has, it looks like somebody just took your jeans apart and sewed them into a skirt. So that's what's really on trend. And also this midi length and even really maxi length skirts are on trend. So I went a little longer, as long as I felt really comfortable with. I don't really feel comfortable with the long, the maxi length. I think that's just gonna weigh me down. But the midi length really works for me. This particular skirt is from Rails. I ordered it from the Rails website. I'll give you a link below to that. And then I topped it with a little halogen top that I showed, I don't know, a few weeks ago here. A little floral print, really nice budget price. Uh, has a little snap there at the neckline, so it keeps you nice and protected there. But it has that, once again, it has that um, kind of elasticized or, you know, pulled together look there at the waist, but I just tucked it in. I just tucked this in. You could belt it or not. You do not have to wear a belt every time you tuck something in, and I chose not to wear one this time. This time I'm wearing my gold sandals. These are Naot sandals, and they're really, I bought them for my trip to London, and I love them. They feel so comfortable, but I think they really work nicely with this skirt because you, anytime you wear a metallic or a nude shoe, it's gonna kind of really elongate those legs, kind of takes away that choppiness that shoes can give you. So I really think they work here. Now a nice wedge heel would probably be ideal, but didn't want to wear heels, wanted to wear something comfortable, so I went with those. But that modern silhouette of the denim skirt is my modern choice here. Now, you know I can't go a full week without wearing linen in the summer, so I am wearing my Frank and Eileen Italian linen pants. These are a little pricey, but you could pull this look off with any linen pants that you have in your closet or even non-linen. But I did top it with a linen little bomber jacket, of course, that I got from Talbot's. I think you've seen these pieces. And just a tank top. You know, tank tops are really on trend. Once again, a very modern choice. That bomber jacket is a modern choice. I could have worn, let's say, a linen blazer here, or I could have worn a cardigan, but neither of those would have looked quite as modern, I think, as a bomber jacket. So I just really like the way I kind of did a tonal thing. And another thing that is really on trend, really of the moment, are matching sets. And so these white pieces are not the same. They're not even from the same brand, but they're both white. And so they match, they create that nice matched set look, very modern. Okay, we're back to those pants from Anthropology, but this time I did get them in a bright blue. So I decided to really step out of my comfort zone and do that. Now to temper that bright blue though, I've topped them with a simple white graphic tee with just black print. So I take what I did to y'all confess, you know, I said it says, hold your horses, and it says horse on the front. But I did call my daughter and I showed it to her and I says, Abigail, 
this doesn't mean anything weird, does it? <laughs> she assured me, no, it does not. You know, ladies, as we're kind of as in our age, sometimes there are things out there on t-shirts, little slogans, whatever, and they have other meanings all of a sudden. So she said, no, mom, it means like, wait a minute. <laughs> so I know that. So anyhow, be careful when you're choosing your graphic tees, but that said, a graphic tee is a very modern choice. I could have just worn a regular white t-shirt and that would certainly work or a black t-shirt, but that graphic tee, cute little graphic tee here in a very safe little slogan here is a very nice modern choice. And this time I did wear some white leather sneakers. I think that's another modern choice. So modern all over the place this time, but just to kind of keep it appropriate to my style essence and also just my level of comfort, I kept this look very pared back. I wore that black belt again, kind of showed that to my daughter. She said, yeah, I like the belt, so keep that on there. So that's what I did. Now here's an outfit I've worn a couple times and I just love it. I am wearing some kind of a stretch cotton and tinsel, I think it is, uh, fabric pant from Eileen Fisher. They're a lantern uh, silhouette, so they're a nice loose fit. Usually in Eileen Fisher, I size down to a small, but for these, because I wanted them nice and roomy in the hips, I didn't want to, you know, them to look tight on me. I did go with the medium. This is probably the only pair of medium pants that I have from Eileen Fisher, but they really work nicely for me. Um, I think these are still available. I'm not for sure about all sizes, but I've just topped them with a white poplin cotton shirt. This one is from Frank and Eileen. You could go with something else. Doesn't have to be that pricey, but I've left that part of the shirt tail out. Now, I know, I know, I, I've looked at that and sometimes I thought, oh, I couldn't do that. But then when I actually looked at these pants, I think it was, on the website, this is exactly how they showed them shown. And I loved it. I wore them this way to my nail appointment. I've worn them this way to other things. And I love it. I feel very casual, uh, it, but it all feels very elevated. It just feels just right. And I love it. So that's a really modern choice just to wear your shirt a little differently. Here I'm wearing another pair of Naote sandals. These are in a nice brown leather, just a very natural look. And for my seventh look, I do have jeans. And this time these are Madewell. Remember I mentioned Madewell is another very modern retailer. And so these are the perfect vintage cropped straight leg jeans from Madewell. I love them. I size down at Madewell. So like my normal size is a 30, but I wear a 29 at Madewell. And these are light because there's not any distressing. There's not a lot of whiskering or fading. They're just a nice, great wash and I do think they're available at Nordstrom where you're going to get free shipping as well as Madewell so I'll give you double links down below because also this little top here is from Halogen at Nordstrom and it's that kind of a silky pretty top so I kind of wore an elevated looking button-up shirt with those jeans. This top is in a rich, beautiful brown, but it also comes in a vibrant red and a gold and a cream, I think. So some great choices. And then I wore a little bit of a heel. Now, somebody asked me recently, don't those heels like make that really harsh clomping sound when you walk? No, they don't. They make a little bit of a flip-flop sound, the little click, click, flip-flop sound, but the heel just sounds like normal heels when you're walking around to me. I love these heels. They're very comfortable. They come in black too. I had them in black too, and they may come in metallic still, but I love the way this outfit pulls together. Very simple. Once again, a modern jean and just kind of worn, styled, very modern. So some modern choices to help you create some new summer outfits as you continue through the summer weeks. Thanks so much for joining me today, ladies. Like I said, I have links below for everything. Give me a thumbs up if you're so glad that today's video is not so long. And leave me a comment. Let me know which of these outfits was your favorite. I look forward to hearing from you and I'll see you again next week. Bye now.